Oh my goodness, here we go again. Right, it's a beautiful evening tonight. Sun's in my eyes a little bit, but I figure let's go and uh, go to the reservoirs. I'm just trying to sort out my boob camera. I'm going to take you to the reservoir and I think today's vlog vlog number two is going to be about the king the bomber and the dog named tip I think this will be a good story oh. Oop. I was a little bit eager there Biker. I enjoy this little dip here. Ready? Whee! It's a little bit of a roller coaster. And the bracken's all dying. You see it going brown now. out here tonight. Whee! This is a fun road. He gets wiggly down at the bottom too. I honestly thought it would be a bit chillier today but it's about 14 degrees and I'm feeling fine in my two jackets, my armor jacket and my leather jacket and then I have a top on. But I have brought because well, I bought a heated vest guys which I am um, so happy about and I thought I might put it on today and test it I just grabbed it as I ran out the door but I don't think I need it today I think I'm heavy breathing today I keep fogging up there's a good few bikers out tonight there tend to be bikers on this road the snake this is now the snake pass uh, it's very popular with riders it's very twisty it's a fun road Okay, so here we are in the Derwent Valley. So it's not far from our house. And it's lovely. So I think in, I think it was like 1900, the early 1900s, about 1902, they decided to build these, these reservoirs. And so they cleared out the valley and when the water is low enough, you can see the ruins of the village or a farmhouse or whatever. So they built these awesome dam walls and kind of gothic. But I love this res these reservoirs. Look at this, how beautiful. Where can I stop? I'm going to go as close as possible. I'm just going to go in here. Right, so look at these, this gothic, these gothic walls. So why you can see that here is because this, these dams were used as flight practice. I think the squadron, what was it, 600 and... 17? 600, was it Squadron 617? Yes, it was. So, so squad, thank you. <laughs> squadron 617 and they came over here to practice because the, these dams, they were to practice low flying because these dams are very similar to the German dams that they needed to bomb. And then six years ago, they did this kind of unique um, f flyby where they got to the last two airworthy Lancaster bombers and they flew in formation over here. And we were lucky enough to be up on the hill. So when they came to fly by, we were actually looking down on the bombers. It was incredible. Um, so there you go. That's the first 
the first thing that I told you on the block, that is the bombers. Look at that, they're all spectacular. And it's wonderful to go down to the bottom there when the water's overflowing, but it's that's not happening right now. Right, let's get back on. And the next thing I wanted to show you here is a dog named Tip. Hopefully no one comes past. Right, see it wasn't far. Hopefully no one will come. Look. Yeah. See? In commemoration of the devotion of Tip, the sheepdog, which stayed by the body of a dead master, Mr. Joseph Tagg, on the Howden Moors for 15 weeks, from the 12th of December, 1953, to the 27th of March, 1954. How sad is that? And it would have been freezing. Amazing dog. Anyway, let's get going. Run. Oh, this is still here. This burnt out old car was here last week. No idea what happened to it. Oh, it's got new graffiti though. Oh, there's a plane flying over. Do you see it? It's not a Lancaster bomber though. Okay, we're coming up to the other wall here. Um, just past here. There we go. So now we're at Haworth Reservoir. Isn't it gorgeous? Kind of gothic looking amazingness. And now I have to remember I'm on the wrong side of the road here. There we go. So we've got to keep on going if you want to find out about King George. Oh, the thing I want to show you about King George. I'm gonna get blinded by the light. Ready? <laughs> have to watch out, we're going over a narrow bridge here. So we have to do a slow look ahead. Now we can go over. Ooh, the bike sounds fun over there driving back from Scotland I got stuck on this road uh, they were back roads uh, for over a hundred miles behind a truck oh there were two trucks actually so I couldn't overtake and it was so frustrating because I mean I don't mind they were doing good speed so it wasn't about going slowly it's just so you just to have a big old truck in front of you blocking your view the whole time. It's almost like being a pillion on a bike. <laughs> joking, joking, joking. Sort of. Oh, it's another old car. How oh, lovely. Here we are. This is what I want to show you. Show this. This tree here was planted on the 25th of September 1945 by His Majesty King George the Sixth. There you go. Last thing. That car looks cool there actually. That's caused my bike though. Okay, so that's it for my vlog about the bombers, the dog named Tip, and the king. So yeah, this is one of my favorite places. I love to come here. It's really um, nice to kind of de-stress and just the, the ride is lovely and the area is beautiful and you don't have to go fast and 
There are fast bits. You don't have to go fast. Thanks for coming with me. Please like and subscribe. And I shall see you next time where I think I'm going to go and test out my heated jacket, which I've just got. <laughs>